Welcome back to Switch Corner, my name is Alex and today we're taking another look at the Cubic and Friends Winterfest sale and now it's open to everyone so let's check out the games and talk about a massive giveaway to celebrate as well. Thanks then to Cubic and Friends for sponsoring today's video and with that luck hit subscribe if you love the Switch as much as we all do here, join our growing family and let's get started. So before we do get to the games then, this sale it brings together Cubic All In Games, Untold Tales, Naptime Games and then also Tate Multimedia and they are going big with the celebrations. Not only huge discounts but a huge giveaway as well, there's over 50 prizes and of those 50, 15 are going to be Nintendo Switch OLED consoles. That's huge though and they're having a bit of fun with the entry requirements, either pick up a game or get creative with photo, video, art and a whole host of other inventive ways. There's 10 in fact related to their titles so head to cubicgames.com forward slash winterfest for all the details and get to work on those entries. Remember then as well, if you do own any of the titles on screen right now, you will receive an extra discount on many of today's games and that runs until the end of December. I've linked my previous video though in the pinned comment down below with all the details because the prices today they are going to be for everyone, those that don't own one of these games. But I have put the owner discount at the top of the screen as well because remember if you don't own one yet, pick one up, you instantly get access to the sales, so that's also another way to play this. So the games are more quickfire and I think we saw in the last video but we're starting with Paradise Last. It releases this week. It's a narrative adventure throwing you into a world where the Second World War had no victor. Instead it culminated in nuclear attacks. Now you're this 12 year old boy living in the aftermath. Your mother died. You're on the hunt for a man in a photo that your mother cherished. Here though that's going to lead you to this mysterious bunker. 40% off it's celebrating the launch. Real Boxing 2 then, also a new release and the title says it all, if you want to get your boxing on, come here. It's packing quick play as well as career though, so it's good for short or extended sessions. The career here, it's not just fights, but training as well, thanks to, you know, like a career calendar. It even has challenges with some over-the-top guests, including the likes of Santa. I need to check it out myself still, but 40% off, it's just good to see some love for boxing. Arm Nam Run then, and I haven't played this one, but a few quick searches seem to be showing positive feedback. I love the colourful visual style as well, but it's an arcade title all about racing, whether that's single player or local. Dodge obstacles though, get through these courses and win, but it's packing some serious content here. There's three modes, there's character customization, 120 levels across nine locations. It's matching the low price with 20% off. Beautiful Desolation next then with 50% off, seriously unique this one, a post-apocalyptic African sci-fi adventure and I loved the story. You're thrown into this dangerous futuristic world after an accident and the old school pre-rendered cutscenes, they are just incredible. Don't expect here something like old school Fallout though, think more adventure and exploration, borderline point and click. Watch a few reviews first though, see if it's going to be one for you. Badland Game of the Year edition then is a celebrated title, tons of incredible reviews and it is deserved. I actually picked it up myself following Switch Up's coverage and it's a side-scrolling action adventure where you set out to uncover a dark secret in this forest, you're one of the forest dwellers. It's all been enhanced though, packs up to like 4 player support and there's then even 100 single player levels and 100 multiplayer. It's over 15 hours of game time which isn't bad at all and it's racking 50% off. Hong Kong Massacre then is for those fans of top down shooters, think Hotline Miami where it's a whole lot of you know one hit kills, it's gonna get challenging as well. There's a couple of shortcomings, a few weak boss encounters that don't really fit the style, but overall really liked it, it's super stylized. imagine John Woo the game where your defense, it's based on aerial acrobatics, a whole lot of gunplay of course and a story of revenge. My review it's pinned down below and it's 50% off. The Urban Trial series then is on sale as well, we have Playground the original which is all about progressing through physics based levels similar to that of Trails, but then the sequel's on sale as well, that mixes things up and goes for a world where you can actually turn left and right, it's more like arenas and you're racking up high scores with a whole lot of stunts. I've always described it myself as 2.5D Tony Hawk on a bike, both of these then currently 87% off. 
A personal favourite then, a cane is a piece of genius. Dependent on your region, you will see a massive price cut on this one, but it's such a good little pick up and play entry. It's that kind of simple bite size idea, but completely addictive and you will keep coming back. Arena based though, hack and slash experience, so basically run around, take out everyone, it's throwing you into that mega Tokyo, it's a neon soaked kind of world, it asks you to kill everyone, it's one it gameplay, there's different weapons to unlock, there's gadgets, there's just all sorts going on, it comes highly recommended, I've had it now for a couple of years, I still come back to it, and it's one of the first recommendations I ever gave in a deals video. Pocket Mini Golf then, and I think it's fair to say here the name says it all, it's Mini Golf with a super clean visual style, it supports up to 4 player local play, there's 50 holes and of course it starts simple enough with its course layout, but quickly escalates with a whole host of obstacles. This is going to be a good one when you simply want to chill and play something that's a little bit, you know, less taxing. It's rocking 20% off. While I'm on multiplayer then tools up and the closest comparison here would be Overcooked but think the home renovation take on the mayhem. If you like what you see as well there's a ton of DLC now available that expands not only on the campaign content but actually the tasks you'll be undertaking as well. The gameplay though fits this genre perfectly, decorate, move items, collect tools, most importantly of course try to work together. For me in our house it's basically argue and scream. It's 85% off though so a super budget way to get into this world if you've ever fancied giving it a go. So our penultimate game of the video then, Mana Spark, another one that's become a bit of an indie classic at this point, it's an action RPG that blends in Souls-like combat and roguelike elements as well, meaning it's for sure not easy, but it's still going to be a pretty good starting point with the genre for maybe those that are new. A whole lot of dungeons though and enemies, and it is actually procedurally generated in the sense the rooms they are handcrafted, but the layout it is mixed up. I love the pixel style though, the enemies, the character animations, the lighting has always stood out to me as well, and it's a decent 10 hour runtime. The game even has a DLC out there that expands things called the Forgotten Crypts. It's super budget as well and really does extend that gameplay. Dependent on region then, you're looking at 80 to 90% off. So our final game of the video then, Metamorphosis, I reviewed this one on the channel and it has issues, I'm going to say that now, but the story is absolutely unique as it throws you into a world influenced by Kafka. You wake up, you've been transformed into a bug, and it basically steals moments from many of Kafka's texts. Think though, first person exploration adventure, you're trying to get to the bottom of all of this, and it has just this great scale to the world around you. Issues wise, the frame rate, but it's very easy to forgive honestly when it's discounted like this with 70% off. And this then, as I said, this is just a small selection of the games on offer right now to name a few more, Bit Trip Runner, Fort Triumph, Dex, Hyper Parasite, Tiny Lands, Golf Club, Wasteland, and the list goes on. Head to cubicgames.com forward slash Winterfest to check it all out. It has everything you need there, all the games, the discounts for those that own games and those that don't. And then of course the all important giveaway information which includes gift cards and OLED consoles. With that then again a shout out to Cubic and friends for sponsoring today's video. It's always a pleasure and this is a great list of publishers and developers. We've got Cubic All In Games, Untold Tales, Naptime Games and Tape Multimedia. So yes, thank you to all of them. A thank you then as well to of course the patrons of the channel who are just going above and beyond to support Switch Corner. It helps more than you know so thank you all so much. Then hit subscribe if you love the Switch. As much as we all do here, join our growing family and I'll see you all on the next video. Thanks everyone.